Remember that movie about the 10 foot blue aliens whose home world gets colonized by mega corporations? You know, the one that made like a quadrillion dollars by this guy? Yeah, this guy. Oh, oh, the aliens are boning. Turn it off. Turn it off. Avatar was a technological feat in 2009. I mean, look at this sh Those blue humanoids sure do look like blue humanoids. Combining these stunning visuals with relevant topics and some pretty cool action, this movie absolutely crushed. So they're gonna make like 900 more of these movies with the second releasing this weekend, actually. James Cameron and Fox Studios are gonna be living in a palace made of money. So we thought what better time to check out this dog turd that released alongside the original movie. Go down and hit the like button with your left eyeball and let's get into this sh**. Oh, and by the way, if you guys want to see our special holiday episode early, it's up on the Patreon right now. On top of that, you also get access to our exclusive Discord, your name in the credits of every video, and some fun behind the scenes stuff we're not posting anywhere else. Okay, now back to this blue alien bullshit. Oh god, is this game made by Ubisoft? Of course it is. They want to make another Avatar game. Can you believe that? Yes. Yes, I can. James Cameron's Blue Man Group. The game. I feel like it's not common that you get a movie where they put the director's name before it, you know? No, that's true. That's true. I can't think of many other examples. You gotta be some egomaniac douchebag to put your name before the title. What the f the hell is this menu? This is really odd. Really odd choice. Op. Mm -hmm. Alright, who are we gonna play as? Male 1? Female 1? Male 2? Female 2? Oh, male 3. One of my favorite characters from James Cameron's Avatar. And this guy, look at this Chad. That doesn't even look like a person. Some of these just don't even look like real people. No, it's like what an AI, an AI system thinks humans look like. It's all AI generated yeah, humans. Yeah. Oh, look at, we have to be this guy, dude. <laughs> he kind of looks like, uh, what's the guy from GTA 4? Oh, Nico Belli. Yeah, he looks like Nico. Oh, hell yeah. First name. Nico. Nico! I'm so, like, excited genuinely to play this because I don't know what, what to expect at all. Like, I've got no clue. Wait, didn't Peter Jackson put his name in front of King Kong? Was it called Peter Jackson's King Kong? I swear it was. Did you hear how long the new Avatar movie is going to be as well? Um, I did. And I heard what James Cameron thought about people who thought it was too long. Yeah, he said, if you miss any parts because you have to pee, just go and see it again. Just go and see it again and put more money in my pocket. Yeah, I'm starting to think James Cameron might be a little bit of an asshole. I don't know. I don't know, though. Oh, Sigourney Weaver, what did they do to you? Why are we even here? What's so important about Pandora? They want to mine minerals, right? They're, they're trying to get... Oh, that's it's it. Like, it's a mineral-rich planet. It's just a classic call. Oh, it's I a see. classic colonizer or tail, right? Ah, uh, yes, we've all heard that one. Mm-hmm, yep. God save the queen. Now, which one of you is Ryder? That's me. Ryder, that's- Whoa, well, No, what? my name's Nico. It's not Ryder. Who's Ryder? I thought I was Nico Bellic. I guess that's our last name, Nico Ryder. Oh, Nico, oh. <laughs> Nico Ryder. <laughs> that's me. Oh, here we are. Oh, the game looks f***ing gross already. <laughs> yeah. It's just got that gross, when did this game come out? 2009 or it something. It feels like, it, it feels like early into the PS3's release, definitely. It has that gross feel where the UI's just kind of slapped on. Put an XP bar there! Ugh. Put, put a mini-map there. <laughs> Whatever this fucking bar is, that's for James Cameron's ego meter. <laughs> How much time will we spend as human? As, as Nico Ryder? I don't know. I thought the whole point is that we're an avatar. I mean... Uh, some of the movie takes place as the, the guy in wheelchair. You remember that guy? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I remember him. Yeah, played by that guy. It was actually supposed to be Matt Damon, but he turned down the role, if you didn't know that. Really? Is that is that a true fact? Is that a fun bit of trivia? It's a fun Avatar fact, guys. Imagine turning down a role on, like, one of the biggest movies of all time. I know, right? Now that, what's his name? I don't even know what that guy's name yeah, is. I, and he, he's I made more know, money dude. than we can even imagine. Yeah, <laughs> pretty much. I've already unlocked 14.3%. We've only just started the game. We haven't done anything. All we've done is walk out of a spaceship, dude. What the fuck's going on? Ladder polyp. <laughs> that doesn't sound good. This is some rich lore, dude. What is oh, that thing? What is that? Why is it showing us its knob? Look, some people are really into this, all right? Some people really care about the home tree songs, okay? Wait, songs? Does it play the songs or does it just like show the lyrics of the songs? No, no, no. It just shows us a picture of this DJ spitting <laughs> straight fire. We're about to become a big blue alien. It's big, big, big blue alien time. I'm excited. Do we get to customize our big blue alien? I think it's pre-made. It goes along with, uh, with Nico Ryder's character. This will seem a little strange. 
This will seem a little strange. You're about to become a nine foot blue alien with a fucking penis for hair. Oh shit, I'm a big nine foot blue alien with a penis for hair. Whoa, it's okay Ryder, this is normal. Sit down and we'll send you back. Dude, we didn't even get to be an, a, a blue alien for more than two seconds. We got to experience standing up and sitting down as a big blue alien. Yeah, that's exciting. Hell yeah, mission completed. Here, yeah. have some XP. Dude, we're so good at this game. Look at this guy. He's like, I'm trying to level up my, my, my World of Warcraft Hunter in time for Dragonflight to release. <laughs> Do you want to add me on Battle.net? That woman's hand has gone through the computer monitor multiple times. Look at this, dude. We get to use an elevator in the world that James Cameron so graciously created for us. Yeah, could, everyone, go down and, and leave a comment. What's your favorite thing about James Cameron? Let's let him know how much we love him. Yeah, let's let's send him a big birthday card saying how much <laughs> we love him at the Mind Pulp community. Thanks, James Cameron. Ryder. Hard to believe you're finally here. Here he is. It's J. Jonah Jameson. Get me a picture of Spider-Man. Seriously, man, you do not want to go beyond the fences, okay? I heard about a dude locked his arm to a plant. A freaking plant. A freaking plant, dude. A freaking plant. Plants are dangerous on this planet. Freaking frick, dude. Watch out for those freaking plants, you frick. Freaking garbage! We got a gun now. Oh, fuck yeah. Can we shoot people? Ah! We've got troops caught in the wire. They're reporting viper wolves moving on them. Viper wolves? Time to kill some viper wolves, I guess. <clears throat> Fucking hell. It went from zero to a hundred, dude. Oh, yeah, your turret section. I love doing those straight after walking around. This thing shreds. I've got to save the troops, dude. Don't let American citizens die. Don't let them get killed by the vapor wolves. Wow, the first objective is get in a turret and kill dogs. Awesome, this game's yeah. 10 out of 10, amazing. Oh my god, Ooh, dude. Ooh, did you like that superhero jump yeah, I did? except you lost half your fucking health. It made James Cameron's ego meter go down a little bit. This isn't over yet. We still have a man deep in the wire. Grab a buggy and help him out. Kid's name is Dalton. Not Dalton, Dalton's one of my best friends. Oh, oh sorry, don't mind me, I'm, I'm just trying to get used to- She's genuinely made of concrete. Hey, wait, look at this dog. Can it attack me in here? I don't think so, it's like stuck on the tire. Um, <laughs> the immersion, the immersion is just inc it's incredible. I really feel like I'm on Pandora right now, dude. Cover your flanks. We got V dogs. Cover your flanks. We got V dogs because it's easier to call them V dogs than Viper dogs. All right, I'm gonna go save Dalton. I don't want to save those guys. Those guys don't give me anything other than XP, and I don't even know what I need that for. Whoa, you get 10 XP for blowing up a random bungus. Calm down. What do you need? I need a signal, and I ain't never done this stuff before. I've never done this stuff before. Yeah, we can tell by the burning buggy in the background. No, you don't. Okay, the shotgun is OP as f Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to stick with the shotgun against these things. Oh my god. This game looks really bad. Yeah, it's... If there's anything I do think about Avatar, it's that it it does look nice. Yeah, yeah, the movie. Oh yeah, yeah, visually it's it's incredible it, like especially for the time that it came out as well i think games and game technology just wasn't there yet dude you got a new gun a new gun and fucking super saiyan i don't need to go super saiyan when i got a fucking shotgun that <laughs> blasts things into space dude do we just keep spawning in yeah it seems like they, they just keep coming out of that same bush over and over Can I just farm yeah, XP? Can farm XP, dude. <laughs> All right, I guess I get back in my car and drive around for 10 more minutes trying to find out. Oh, no, wait. <gasps> There's the gator. Oh, my God. That's a boat. Does it shoot? What are those wings on the side? No, that's just how it drives. Whoa, Whoa what was that? What was that? It was like a Pandora deer. That's one of the crazy animals that James Cameron envisioned for the world of Avatar. What a genius. What is this? What, a room with a bed in it? This looks like an empty video game, Max. It's got no walls. <laughs> This is just nothing. There's just Ugh. nothing to the world. You could tell that they were kind of rushed to get this out, I bet. Yeah, it seems like that. <gasps> Grenade launcher? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> 
I kind of don't blame the Navi for hating us, you know? Yeah, we just came here and just, just with machine guns and grenade launchers and started shooting up V dogs. I think I just made those those weird Pandoran deer extinct. Yeah, I think one of them exploded for sure. You got one. I saw a little plus five XP show up and I was like, oh yeah, that was probably a that was probably a non-enemy. Hey, come back here, you fucking stupid deer thing. What are you guys even supposed to be? Oh, oh my god, dude. I went hunting with a grenade launcher and got blown up. <laughs> That's what we were trying to do the first time. Oh, here it is. This is what the guy sits in in the movie. Yeah, wheelchair guy one, whatever his name is. Oh, there we go. Oh, and we got shit. a fucking gap. Oh, wait, look where I am. Oh, now I figured out what this room was for. With no walls. It's actually glass. It's where this guy wakes up. It's where Avatar Man spawns. Oh, what the f was that? What, what, what the f did you just do? <laughs> I don't know. Woo! Was that, is that an attack or a jump? That's how I traverse the environment. Hey, Whee! 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 Look how tall I am. God, he's Damn. giant. Look at my weird blue tail. <laughs> As an avatar, Pandora's flora and fauna is less aggressive. Therefore, killing inoffensive creatures and plants will not yield experience. So I didn't need to just shoot these V-dogs. Oh my god, oh my god, why are you killing them? Why are you killing them? But, well, why did I spawn with a fucking minigun then if you didn't want me to shoot them? Hey, you guys aren't supposed to be aggressive. What are you doing? Ow! Ow what the f oh my god, I think it's because you killed their cousins, dude. Let's get you up to speed. Straight to it, huh? Ah, uh, my apologies. It's been one of those days. I'm sure we'll be the best of friends. Or... The worst of enemies. Oh my god, who says that? Enemies. The first time. Who says that? A psych fun. psychopath, dude. Now, a psychopath please, says that. Yeah, the first time you meet somebody, that's what they say. That's a red flag. I'm gonna be honest. That's a red flag. Look at this stupid getup this guy's wearing. You like my vest? How did they get him such a big vest? Like, where did they get these human clothes that are like nine feet long? Look. You'd be surprised what Adidas makes, all right? Epstein. Oh, oh no. I don't want to do anything for this guy. Okay, so Epstein wants us to gather plant samples. That's good. We're working with fucking... <laughs> no, we're not. We're not. We're not. We're not working with anyone, all right? We're just gathering things right now. Right, this guy's name's Kevin Epstein, all right? He's just not... He's with Kev Kevin. Yeah, no relation to the other one. Is that one of the big plants? I don't oh, think you oh, shoot oh, them, oh, dude. Oh. I don't think you're supposed to shoot... I think you're supposed to, like... <laughs> Interact with it. You don't have to just shoot everything. But I'm uh, I'm a human stuck in a blue man's body. I need to get used to it. Right. You got. You still got the human attitude. Exactly. I, that's how the movie is, right? He starts with his human attitude, and it changes when he falls in love for a blue woman. Oh yeah. I forgot. Like the whole like movie is basically about him fucking an alien. It's basically Fern Gully. <laughs> oh my god. Or Mass Effect. Uh, James Cameron was like, okay, so, and then there's gonna be a part of the movie when Wheelchair Man has sex with a big blue alien. Yeah, but it's not like conventional sex, all right? No. They use their hair. They, they attach their, their hair, hair together. And they were like, uh, what, the same hair that you use to attach to animals? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, exactly, yeah. Yeah, but in like in a sexual yeah, way. Yeah, but this time it's it's because the. Right? <laughs> and then Matt Damon went, "Yeah, I don't think I want to be a part of this movie. Actually, never mind." Oh, do I have to shoot this thing? Yeah, I. Was there any was there any question whether or not you were going to shoot it? I mean, even if I look, euthanize six stern beasts. That's what that's what he asked me to do. I love how it says euthanize. That's what I'm doing because I'm not. I'm not killing them. I'm not murdering them. I'm euthanizing them. I'm euthanizing them with like 300 machine gun rounds to the skull. With prejudice. Yeah. Copy. Locked on. Airstrike here. Airstrike. Oh my God. No, 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 no. Whoa. We don't need an airstrike. Whoa. What are we airstriking? I dealt with the things. Whoa. Guys, what, the, what are you doing, guys? Oh, oh my God. Oh my. <laughs> they're just destroying everyone's homes. Wow. Okay. I was right there. Oh, look at these things. These big, what are they? Can I touch it? <gasps> Whoa, oh, dude. I can ride whatever it is. Oh, we even get a GTA style tailing mission. If there's one thing I just do not like, it's a tailing mission. I'll be honest, dude. Oh, I hate tailing I missions. Don't the like scourge them. of video games. Ugh. Almost as bad as the sewer level. And then it always turns into a chase, you know, every single time. Yeah, yeah. Or just a big brawl. Think about what you're doing. Any of this look familiar? Wait, that's... Yeah, that's where the Navi used to live. 
before you stepped in. Yeah, and air striked it. Yeah, yeah. This guy's like, I don't have anything to do with that. Literally, all we've been doing is running around setting up targeting beacons. <laughs> yeah, and shooting animals. Do I get to choose whether I'm on the, the good guy side or the bad guy side? That would be cool. Oh, sh wait, do we get to decide? We might get to choose. The Navi could use you. Oh, we get to choose, dude. No way. Well, what do we want to do? Do we want to shoot Big <laughs> Blue Man? <laughs> Do we want a genocide? I don't want a genocide particularly. <laughs> I'm not sure I, I don't want particularly to. want to. No. Um I mean we could do the, either the pacifist run or the genocide run, dude. It, I'll let you decide. Oh, he went with the pacifist run. Okay, we're doing it, dude. I'm, I'm going big blue man. I'm going big blue. It's called Avatar the game, right? It's not called Military Man on Planet yeah, that's the game. True, yeah. James Cameron's Military Man on Planet <laughs> genociding the whole populace. Those long-range missiles will fry this whole sector. Your new friends got anything better than bows and arrows? Dude, that's all the I mean when the arrows are like 6 feet long, they're they're pretty fucking effective. You'd impale someone with one of them. Oh my god, yeah, you would be toast. Your whole body would explode. Okay, sh we're in we're in the Navi uh, city, I guess. Oh, I even got I even changed my getup for it. Oh my god, we have a, a, a loincloth now. Beidamo, he's the guy I need to talk to about an Ekron. Then you must offer token of respect. Find rare fireweed. Oh, we need to get that fire weed, Some bro. Some fire weed, <laughs> dude. Fire Everyone weed. loves that fire weed. Yeah, yeah. How many of these games do we have to play where our objective is collect some fire weed for some guy? Yeah, for some old man who can't find fire weed on his own. <laughs> is it? What's it when we shoot that thing? Okay. And what, what does that do? Oh, it explodes and shifts all the <laughs> rocks. Okay, I, whatever. Yeah, I just changed the whole landscape of Pandora. Yeah, what the? F so I could get some weed. <laughs> what is this? You try to buy my trust with this? Yeah, it's from fire weed. Oh great! Now I go around and collect things. It's like an MMO. Dude. Yeah, the I was thinking are like that. M an MMO. Yeah, I was thinking that exact same thing. It's like an MMO, but okay, you fucking died, dude. No, I didn't. I'm a Navi. I can just do that. Right, you do your weird little dance and you're. James Cameron ego bar goes all the way to the top. <laughs> what other weapons do we have besides the... Is it just the machine gun? Um, oh, what the fuck is machine that? Machine gun. Oh, I got a big f blade. Whoa, whoa. Oh, wow. This is like a, an Elden Ring weapon. I want to use this thing. This looks badass. Yeah, that's awesome. Oh my god, chop him up, dude. Oh my Kill god. Him. Oh no, I'm almost dead. Okay, they're actually doing damage to me now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a lot of them. That's why. They're, oh, this isn't good. everywhere. Did you hear that? Did you hear that? <laughs> you see your teammate go flying past you with an arrow in his head. What do you say? Did you hear that? Did you see that person's aim with the bow and arrow? <laughs> uh, oh, uh, okay, they, uh, they died. Can I just kill these guys before they spot me? Hey, wait, is that a big blue guy? Ugh! I got a fucking mace. Oh my god, yeah, it's like a beating club. Oh my god. The Tolonyu Club won. Looks like a pineapple with spikes. What is this? What? How did these people get here? Oh my god. Oh yeah, this thing's awesome. Wow, this thing shreds. Pineapple on a stick is dope. Ugh. We have to dodge more, I think, dude. Jesus Christ. But I don't want to go flying off the edge, all right? Oh my god, that's, that's true. That's true. I didn't even think about that. If I dodged the wrong way here, I would go flying off, and that would not be good for anyone. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. Everything is crumbling. All my friends are dead. Oh, Push me no, to the no, edge! No! no. How did you save yourself, dude? What? Oh. 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 Everything is everything is crumbling in front of everything me. Everything is awesome. Everything is cool when you're part of a team. Everything is awesome. I love, I love Wego. Wego. Oh hell yeah, dude! It's time. Oh look, look how beautiful they look. They look they look scary as. F I know, right? I wouldn't want to ride one of these fucking things. Look at it. Oh, this is badass. See, this is what I wanted from an Avatar game. Are we going to get to th uh, fly through onion rings or no? I mean, that's kind of what we're doing right now, but there's no onion rings. Oh! I'm just flying f through, like, look at the minimap. I am flying through onion rings, but not quite. Yeah, they're like glorified. They're like glorified onion rings. I guess it's maybe showing me it's like 
You said the game wasn't open world. Well, look at this. Look how big it is. It's actually being massive. How do I land? Oh, there we go. Oh, no. I have to find a specific place to land and then I can land. Wow. Sometimes I can't, I can't even get off my thing. What is he doing? What is he doing? <gasps> I can call a viper wolf or whatever it's called to come help me. Dude. It's purple. Purple viper wolf. I don't like the Navi weapons, dude. I'm going to be honest with you. It's kind of shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at, and they're just nonstop barraging me. <laughs> I can't escape from it. There's no cover. There's no block. There's no nothing. I've got finite ammo. There's dodge, which doesn't even dodge anything. All right, what can I do now? Plant a bomb and just fly off again? Yeah, yeah, don't, don't even worry. Don't even worry about fighting them. Just fucking run. Because I can just fly away, look. Boom. Now, let's look at it. Boom. Oh, yeah, so that's yeah. the Okay. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> so is this my bird for the whole game? Because I hate to say it, but James Cameron's ego meter is really low. <laughs> we need to feed his ego in some way. We love you, James. We love you, James. We love you, James. James. Love James. I really want to see another Terminator film, James. Oh, oh my oh, God, oh, dude. Oh, oh, You're so oh. lucky. Oh. All right, what do I do? Do I just just hit it with a yeah, stick yeah, and just, it comes down? Just put, your, <laughs> just put your stick in it. You just stabbed it once and it's like, Mayday, Mayday. We're going down. Mayday, Mayday. Someone put a stick in it. Return to the... Oh. Sake, dude. Oh my god, this game. I think that might be a natural ending. You think that would be a good point to end it? Okay, uh, James Cameron's Avatar The Game. Oof. It was pretty boring, wasn't it? It was pretty boring. I wouldn't say it's up there as one of the worst games of all time. I think it it's definitely playable. It was just made to cash in with the movie. Mm -hmm. Probably one, it might even be one of the last big game movie cash-ins. Thank you to all the patrons uh, who subscribe to the Patreon. We appreciate all of you very much. We appreciate the support. You're helping us create content on games like this. And uh, yeah, we'll see you guys in the next video. Yeah, we'll see you there.